Senior Corps at Missoula Aging Services is Missoula's volunteer hub. Hundreds of volunteer opportunities await. You can help improve reading skills, school attendance, and the well-being of students, provide services that help older adults, or find out about countless other opportunities that will capture your interest. Because your heart's desire never ages, now is the time to reinvent yourself. Discover your perfect volunteer opportunity by calling 728-7682. Hey guys, we're here with uh, Larry Kuchenruther and um, Colleen Kernan, and the, you guys are here to talk for March for Meals. So tell us a little bit more about Meals on Wheels and what you guys are doing in March. Okay, well March is the annual fundraising effort for Meals on Wheels across the nation. Uh, our fundraising efforts will go from March 1st to March 31st, and anybody can help with the fundraising. Our goal, each year we need to raise $100,000 to keep the meal, the uh, Meals on Meals program running as it as it does, we are very fortunate. No waiting list for our clients, and the reason we can do that is because of uh, all of the incredible contributions that people make. So our our goal for the month is sixty thousand dollars to raise. <laughs> and um, I noticed that, uh, of course, the Meals on Wheels is one of your uh, rapidly growing uh, programs, especially with uh, such a, a large aging population here in Missoula, yep. and also with the expansion of you're also going beyond Missoula County as well. Um, what can you say about um, the growth and how much money you guys are going to need as well? Because you did just say that you need about sixty thousand for the month. For the month. Yep, that's the goal for wow. March. Yeah. And then a hundred thousand for the whole year, and we do our our particular program. We uh, we we serve Missoula County first, right? Like you're you're saying outside of yeah. Missoula County, there are other programs that serve outside of Missoula County, but it's not ours. Oh, okay. We oh, yeah, with, Missoula we, County is a large yeah. county. Regardless, it kind of, <laughs> kind of feels like when you go out of the county, it's like little, like those little towns, like French towns, like it's still in Missoula. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. 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 So. <laughs> and so we do work in accordance like with Ravalli County, so that people in the low, low area where they're kind of on the border, they'll still be able to receive services and have nutrition brought into their homes, helping them to maintain their dignity, health, and uh, independence. Yeah, that's the, what the program's uh, about. The the um, a Missoula Agent Service way, their mission statement and all that. That's right. Um, so also, does the money that go that comes from the March for Meals also go to any other Missoula Agent Services program? Nope. March for Meals is strictly for our Meals on Meals program. Yep. And um, yeah. you guys also work with many other programs to um, help give food some to some of the uh, um, aging population here in Missoula in, in and around as well. So it's like a Monday through Friday uh, deal yep. for a lot of people who uh, have a fixed income who need uh, a certain amount of meals just to get through the day. Well, all of the, the whole criteria for qualifying for Meals on Meals is that an individual is homebound to a certain degree. So it's not about their a person's socioeconomic status, it's about their homebound status. So we may have a person who, uh, say, just had hip replacement surgery and are temporarily homebound. Well, that's when we can come in and bring that good nutrition, which will aid in their healing. So they'd only be receiving meals on a temporary basis. Uh, but then there are other folks who are more chronically homebound, and we can continue to serve them. Yeah. Okay. And uh, Larry, what can you say about March for Meals? Uh, well, I'm, I'm one of about 130 uh, volunteers that drive every awesome day. Awesome volunteers that drive. And we, we've got, mm -hmm. what, 17 routes, 16 routes 16 every routes. day. Mm -hmm. We deliver about 230 meals a day uh, in, in Missoula County. And uh, uh, lost my train of thought. <laughs> well, and you know what, it's actually increasing. As, as you know, Larry, Larry's been driving for us for many years, and it now we're serving closer to 300 meals a day. Oh, is that right? Yep, as you know, because your route, the routes yeah. get bigger. One thing I didn't realize, Scott, was that um, you don't have to sign up for like a year program or something like that. If, if you need it for a week or two weeks, um, you're eligible for that if you're going to be homebound. And a lot of people may figure that it's it's a commitment for a year or six mm -hmm. months to get the meals. So, And I really wasn't totally aware of that yeah. until just so recently. It's, so Meals on Wheels is for as long as you need it. Yep. For as long as you're homebound. Great. Mm -hmm. And so let's talk about uh, where uh, people can um, um, can donate and where people can get more information from. Okay. So we have a few events going on during March for Meals. On uh, March 9th, it's our Community Champions Day, and that's when our mayor 
and mm -hmm. several of our other elected officials, I pair them up with our volunteers and they go and deliver meals oh. and actually serve their constituents a lot of the time, which is really pretty cool, I think. And then on March 11th, we'll be represented at the Women's Fair and on the 31st, it's Community Jeans Day and we'll be, the Meals on Meals program will be the recipients of uh, that community donation, which is also pretty cool, I'd say. Cool. Um, and, and then we do have a new thing this year. It's called uh, crowdfunding. And so it's a way for people to do fundraising online. And if you go to our Missoula Aging Services website, uh, www.missoulaagingservices.org, mm -hmm. uh, right at the top, there's a magenta banner. And you can click on that to find out about fundraising options online. We also, people can still come on in and grab a donation form and uh, collect donations that way as well. Any questions, just call Missoula Aging at 728-7682, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> so um, also uh, Meals on Wheels is, uh, uh, it, it obviously is a great resource for a lot of people to mm -hmm. take advantage of, but you're also looking for drivers all the time. Yep. So uh, um, what are some of the uh, criteria for being a driver? Uh, clean driving record is first and foremost. Um, also, the ability to bring a, bring a meal with a smile. The, of course, the nutrition is the primary uh, aspect of the program that's benefiting our recipients. But the other thing that's so important is that when our volunteers come and bring the food, they're providing a daily check-in. And so, uh, like I say, friendly service with a smile, you know, a smile can brighten a person's day. And for many of our recipients and clients, they won't be seeing anybody other than their Meals on Wheels driver during the day. So it provides a, a very important, that social interaction that when we're all human, we all like to interact and say right. hello. That's great. So. Well, is there anything else you guys want to harp on? <laughs> I don't, it, it's fun. It's very enjoyable for, as a volunteer. Something I look forward to. I do it three days a week and, mm -hmm. and I thoroughly enjoy it. And, and you're, you're seeing the same clients or, or different clients every day. So uh, yeah. it's, it's just fun to get, get out and meet these people. Yep. And, and they enjoy meeting us as they well. They do. They do. <laughs> Well, thanks, guys, for joining yeah. me. Um, once again, you, if you guys want more information, go to MissoulaAsianServices.org, mm -hmm. and you can find out more information on how you can donate and how you can get involved. Um, if you don't want, if you want to donate, you can still get involved. Go yeah. to the website. You can donate, and you can get involved. It's yep. either, or it's <laughs> an All and. sorts of options. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks, guys. <laughs>